Hello, this is Dee Damson and today we are going to paint another rose and we're going to have a little bit more details on the um, outside of the rose but the main rose will be super super simple and I will have the traceable for you a week or week and a half after the video is posted on YouTube um, and it will be on my Facebook page but pretty much all the shape of the rose are kind of like C shapes and they overlap um, I'm making the outer um, area of the petal lighter color and the inner it's going to be at a darker color so you can do it any color you want I'm using cadmium yellow deep hue which is like orangey yellow and also I'm using the cadmium red and crimson and I am just emphasizing on the shadow part and I have the two other uh, very transparent layers with the orange and with the cadmium red um, kind of taking the rest of the petal um, adding a little bit more yellow just to kind of punch the colors a little bit but if you add too much uh, you can always take away and you're gonna see in a couple of areas how I decided to do that for the petals if you see how I'm uh, moving my brush around it's pretty much creating a bigger base and then moving left to right and giving a little bit of kind of points to the outside of those uh, leaves which i'm not quite creating leaves it's just like an illusion of a leaf but they're more like a triangle shapes that have pointy ends um, i'm using the color that i'm using is the sap green which is beautiful green and also i'm adding the cadmium yellow deep hue which is like an orangey yellow and a little bit of ochre yellow ochre and adding a little bit of uh, green mixed with blue um, around the rose right underneath the rose kind of to push that rose forward and now with the crimson red i'm adding a little bit more into the shadow and then i'm running a clean brush and softening the edges but it's very important to leave these lighter areas on the ends of those petals and i'm gonna add a little bit of blue all around just to take the space but pretty much is like wet on wet technique and you're just dropping color in and just leaving the color to have fun around your canvas and here is where um, i have to take a little bit of the colors because um, it was getting a little bit too dark but pretty much that's it so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell and i'll see you next week thanks for watching bye